In our quadratics functions course, we must learn how to graph a parabola. The next step is how to find the vertex. This is what example 1 looks like before we find the vertex. The formula for our vertex is negative b over 2a for the x-coordinate, negative delta over 4a for the y-coordinate. Our b is negative 3, so the negative of b is the negative of negative 3. a is 2. So 2a is 2 times 2. Our delta is 17. So negative delta is negative 17. a is 2, so 4a is 4 times 2. The negative of negative 3 is positive 3. And 2 times 2 is 4, so our x-coordinate is 3 over 4. Our x-coordinate is 3 quarters. Four times two is eight, so our y coordinate is negative 17 over eight. If you have trouble finding that on a graph, negative 17 over eight is equal to negative 2.125. The y coordinate of our delta is negative 17 eighths. Let's graph this. 3 quarters is here. Negative 2.125 is down here. This is our vertex. This is what example 1 looks like after finding the vertex. This is what example 2 looks like before we find the vertex. To find the vertex of our parabola, we use the vertex formula. Negative b over 2a, negative delta over 4a. Our b is 5, so negative b will be negative 5. Two a means two times negative two. Our delta is nine, so negative delta is negative nine. And four a means four times negative two. Two times negative two is negative four. And four times negative two is negative eight. The negative signs top and bottom cancel, so our x-coordinate is 5 fourths. And they cancel here as well, so our y-coordinate is 9 eighths. We have to put this point into our table and on our graph. Five fourths is about here, 9 eighths is about here, so our point for the vertex is now on the graph. This is what example 2 looks like after we find the vertex. This is what example 3 looks like before finding the vertex. To find the vertex for example 3, we use the vertex formula. Negative b over 2a, negative delta over 4a. Filling in the values, our b is negative 4. So it's negative of negative 4 over 2a. 2a is 2 times 4. Our delta is negative 48. So we have negative of negative 48 over 4a, which is also 4 times 4. Negative of negative 4 is positive 4. 2 times 4 is 8. Negative of negative 48 is positive 48. 4 times 4 is 16. Our vertex simplifies to one half three. We put this in the table 
and on the graph. The way this is scaled, one half is here, three is here, our vertex ends up being about here. This is how they find the vertex, for example, three. This is what example three looks like after finding the vertex. This is what example four looks like before we find our vertex. To find the vertex of example four, we're using the vertex formula, negative b over 2a, negative delta over 4a. Let's fill this in. Negative b means negative 4. 2a means 2 times negative 1. Negative delta means negative 0. And 4a means 4 times negative 1. Negative 4 divided by negative 2 is 2. And negative 0 over 4 times negative 1 simplifies to 0. We have found our vertex and it is 2, 0. Let's put this on the graph. 2, 0 with this scaling is here. This is how we find the vertex of example 4. This is what example 4 looks like after we find the vertex. Be sure to watch the next video in the process of graphing a parabola.